14 to five. And there's Toby Naga. There no he is. good. Denim Dawson flying for the offensive rebound. And there, don't give him two looks at it. Right back ain't cheating. Tommy Naga, just a little bit of space needed. There's not a shot that Tommy Naga doesn't like. <laughs> there he is again. Deep for three. He is feeling it. Feeling it. Tommy Naga, quick fire three. Doesn't lack confidence, does he? No. <laughs> Off the bench, he's making things happen. The junior from downtown knocks down the three. Tomanaga, the lefty three switch. They just had to try to get through that Breidenbach screen, and Tomanaga, as a result, was open to shoot the three. Yeah, he got away. He forced that one a little bit. Thought he had a chance to kick it up. Somehow got the pass to Bandumel, and a three from Tomanaga rims out. Walker keeps it alive, and the second chance for Tomanaga from the corner is good. Because they start to fatigue. You can't sustain the type of pressure they want to play for 30 minutes. Tomanaga. Yeah, that's basically what it is, the turnover. Tomanaga just in rhythm right now. When you space, defenses have a more difficult time of rotating. Well executed by BC. Tomanaga for the lead, yes. Greasel for three. Key to the offensive board. Tominaga wants three more. Yes! Yeah, this starts with Blaze Kata just going and getting an offensive rebound, double team. Look at Tominaga. He makes himself available. Okay, say Tominaga really rotating well that bothered the shot. There's Tominaga from deep. Man, is he feeling it. He's up to 20. He remains scoreless at 16 points in their last two games each. Tominaga wants another one. He can't miss. Knocks it down. Boy, is he fun to watch. Just tremendous enthusiasm for the game. Then takes a victory lap on the opposite end. <laughs> Go ahead, just bump the stance. Just have some fun, they say. Got it to within seven a couple of times, but a 14-0 run for Indiana really separated them. As Tome Naga starting to get hot, he's got nine. Riesel still without a point. And that is good. Three by Kasey Tomanaga. Kata got away with the foul there, grabbed Edie's shoulder as he made the turn. Tomanaga. The lawyer trying to close out on Tommy Naga, and his momentum carries him in to Casey. And no whistle. Morton for three off the side of the backboard. Here comes Tommy Naga. Transition three. You don't need a three in this possession. Get downhill. One time out left. Greasel looking for help. Tommy Naga. What a tie game. Nine seconds to go. On the run, Casey Tommy Naga. How do you do? He's got 17. I mean, Braden Smith couldn't be any better defensively. He was right there on the catch, but that's just a heck of a finish. A shot, rather, holding up the follow through. Tommy Naga's hit some tough threes here in the second half. Four for six from three in the game. Where would this this Nebraska team be without Kese Tomenaga? Well, not like what Emmanuel Vandermeer did after Tomenaga hits the three. He's calming his teammates down. He's like, listen, we haven't we haven't finished the game. Greasel has been a little quiet. You you talked about before we got going. You'd like to see him going, but speaking of getting going, how about Kese Tomenaga? <laughs> Kese. We've got a mismatch with Keita on the inside with Turner. Tominaga, what did I say? He better hit it. He better hit it. Oh, you know Tominaga. he likes that. There's, yes. There's not one that Tominaga doesn't like. 
you got to have hands up, high and active against Derek Walker at all times. That's going up. So he now got up top for three. Five quick points. Was able to get that down. That's hard to do. A double clutch three. Tominaga trying to answer and he does. First points for KC Tominaga. You hear that term, the game slowing down, and it does seem like, again, he's new to basketball. I mean, that's what the crazy thing about it is. You know, only been playing for about five years is Tominaga hits the three. That's the thing that really, one of the things that really impresses me about him. A career high for Fletcher Lawyer. He's at 24. Tominaga hits it. ED. And Walker step in front of him there. Now Tominaga resets for three and hits it. Missed dunk, worth nothing. Made layup, two. Tominaga, deep three. Three. That's three. That's, see, that's math. <laughs> Picked up for both squads here in the second half. That three-point shot made possible. Wide open layup at one end, missed. Go down to the other end and score it. Tominaga still trying to get into a rhythm. That's what he needed. Big shot there for the Cornhuskers. And go to work. They double him. Tominaga starting to feel it. Boom, another one. Three points, they say Tominaga. Speaking of Tominaga, he's starting to heat up. He's got Nebraska within five now. Barnheiser, baseline, in trouble. Greaser got a hand. Greaser, end to end, driving to the rim. The dish, Tominaga, it was low. He waits, he shoots, and he scores! Look at this as Greaser with a great push. Just the pass is a little off target. Goes to the ground. This is a lineup where with no Greasel, no Walker, where's the playmaking going to come from? Warren's trying to provide it out to Tomenaga. He'll try the three, and he'll hit it again! 15! It's been raining threes here in Lincoln. Incredible. Tomenaga, the hottest guy in the gym. Tomenaga for three. Getting it going again, Casey Tomenaga. Nebraska off to a 5 of 7 start from the field. Tominaga had the first 12 against Northwestern the other day. His first three goes down. And Reeves can guard Derek Walker. You look at where the hands are for Dante's. I had an interview after the Wisconsin win. He said the Illini have similar characteristics as that national championship Baylor team. Now Epps. And he turns it over. Tominaga the steal. Watch Tominaga, he can pull. And he does. And hits. That's a big time play. He's known for his three-point shooting. The Illini lack of defensive communication allows him a walk-up three. Here's Tominaga on the run for Nebraska. Tominaga, not there. The follow by Dawson, no. Now Tominaga for three. Got it. Boy, great action by Nebraska. The chemistry, the synergy, no one's more fun to watch at the offensive end than Penn State Nittany Lions. So many shooters out there. Yes. Tominaga's a shooter, and he knew it. Posing after the three. There's Walker. Tominaga, he'll shoot from way back. Oh, he's feeling it today. They need scoring. They're desperate for it. Well, he's answering the call. Big time shot by number 30. Huskers do to start the second half here in Lincoln. Denim Dawson, here's Tomainaga trying to pick up where he left off, and he will. A three, just 13 seconds into the second half. Well, Tomainaga is shooting it like this. Sometimes as a player, Kevin, you just have to forget the scout report. You know, you know what you're supposed to do, but there are times instinctively you have to do what you have to do. Five to shoot, Tomainaga forcing it up, and it falls anyway. Well, I know where I'm going with my family for summer vacation this year. I'm going to the Panhandle because that's where Tominaga's been hitting these shots. These are deep. <laughs> They're long. Everybody loves it. Tominaga lost that one on the way up. It was tipped. Gets it back and hits. 30. 18 assists.
to just three turnovers the last four, but hasn't necessarily been efficient shooting it. Now, when Jalen Llewellyn went down, his role really increased. Tominaga picking up where he left off in Lincoln. Side six foot four, Kevin Cook. Tominaga <laughs> with the shot fake by in time and hitting the three. He is in some kind of groove right now. Two to shoot, one to shoot, buffed in. Off with that three. Greasel the rebound, good defense by Nebraska, now trying to get the break going. Tominaga, the three in the corner, rolls it home. He's got 11. McDaniel hanging there, Didn't do his pull-up. Breidenbach for three, in and out. Rebound, Derek Walker. Here's Tominaga, he'll try from deep, and he'll hit. That's an incredible pass from Derek Walker. They're trying to rotate another fresh defender because of how well Tominaga moves without the ball. Nice job by Asijo. Shot clock doesn't reset. Tominaga looking for his first bucket. There it is to wake up Pinnacle Bank Arena. The, this is the resulting after good hustle by a siege in a couple possessions ago. This is deep with the shot clock winding down. And because of his ability. It's a nice passing in close quarters. Yeah, you cannot. Klesman got kind of caught up in that action far side. Nice block out by Kata there. Really good job by Kata of getting a body on Crowell. Tominaga looking for back-to-back yeah. -back threes. He finds it. That could spark the run that Nebraska needs. Nebraska going real big right now with both Walker and Blaze Kata on the floor. Tominaga, wow! All 14,811 wanted that to go down. And most recently, even though he fumbles it, man, how quickly does he get that up and out? Because Klesman was right there and Nebraska has not led with a three they potentially could. Tominaga steps back. He wants the three and hits it. <laughs> and watch him at the bottom. He just keeps moving. And Klesman got wiped out. Kind of got knocked to the floor of the primary defender. You see him going down to the screen right there. And then a really good job by Greasel. And they did just that and found a, a wide open Wiltshire. Walker flies in for the offensive rebound. Tominaga drills the three, and we're tied again. Tominaga lost McConnell and drilled the three. You got to know who you're fighting. This Rutgers team, they're gritty. Maybe she's They're waiting. workers. Rutgers turns it over. Maybe she's waiting for the end of the game to bring up the big poster the that she made, and you're going to eat those. Tominaga drills another. Tillman Hug has been really good in transition. He drills one. Wilchers get back up off the bench for Nebraska. Tominaga can't miss in the second half. It's really the offense and what it's centered around is trying to free up Tominaga for threes because the attention he attracts just like this right on cue can create opportunities for other in and out of the gaps when Walker's going to work. Tominaga, deep three, and a huge bucket for Casey. Well, one more time, look at the staggered screen. You don't communicate a switch, you get hung up. Ola Joseph and Payne, those are three guys, first-year players here in the Twin Cities. That keep an eye on. There's Tominaga from out deep. Either team with the range early, both 0 for 2. And this is a Michigan State team that's 39% overall as a squad, second in the Big Ten in that area. Tominaga, there's a three. Game, everything we expected. It gets started. Tominaga showing you why he's more than 40% from behind. To go with six points. There's Tominaga, three, up, and down. You wouldn't know he's 30% from behind the arc. Tominaga, there's no question. This is what he does as well as anybody. 40%, 100% here. And forcing Nebraska to defend all the defensive real estate leads to a wide open three. I think Hauser got on the bus tonight for Michigan State. Tominaga with the answer. 13 for Kaysen. Short on that shot. Lawrence, a career high 13 points on the push. Tominaga waits. Three up. Oh, he wasn't even looking at the rim when it went through. Tominaga. We saw it go in. Now, watch the release. He doesn't even look to see if it goes in. He knows. Watch him turn his head. Oh, that's gold, <laughs> Jerry. Here's CJ Wiltshire. Kese Tominaga. Deep three. No problem for Kese. And when they were a defensive-minded team early in the season with Vanderbilt and Gary, they, they were really 
putting the brakes on. Now they're playing with a little more pace, and you cannot lose track of him. Tomonaga off the screen, money from the top of the key. It's the Tomonaga three. That's that elevator play. He is flying right through it. Henley late from that left corner. Very well done. Yeah. Hey, your job's up there. No, it's not. And Tomonaga says three pointers aren't hard.